Greetings, it's me, Firebee, and welcome back to the Pokemon Sun and Moon Special Demo Edition. Ooh, it's night. Good. I've always been wondering what the game looks like at night. Pretty nice. Also, I've heard... Yeah! Let me see if I can get to some place that has a better camera angle for that. Um... Oh, right. First I need to talk to you, don't I? You came! Thanks! Here's the good shit I promised you. Oh boy, ten pretty wings. Literally useless. It passes by so slowly. But time really is important, isn't it? And how holy city, there's somebody you'll probably want to go see in a few days. Yeah. Yeah, there's a few people. Like, um... You down here. What's the time for you? Four days? Okay. And there's a few other people around. I have a list somewhere for them. Um, let's see. Is anything different in here? I'm curious. Oh, hello. Well, Zadas can be dangerous. They're so good, I cannot stop eating them. Okay. I'm not sure I ever actually went to look at that. I'm liking the music here at night. I'm pretty sure this is different. Alright, let's get on Taurus. Yep. Spamming B causes an annoying sound. Good. I have heard correctly. Let's just go around up here. Because I also hear tell. Hey, you. Really nice place. Let's go. Oh man, everything's been covered with rocks again. This is terrible. Let's clear this back out. Hey, you're back again. I'm the mysterious old man. Oh, it's you again. I know you came all the way out here and all, so I'm really sorry, but I don't have anything else to give you. Even if you came back, come back again, I still won't have anything. What a mysterious gay. Clearly the game thought that was important because it saved. Is there a better camera angle for that? Maybe on the beach there would be. Ah, good. If you spam B trying to run, you trip. Or almost trip. It's the little things. Yeah, let's go back to Holly City. I want to see what the beach looks like at night. Also, riding Toros will not get old. Not anytime soon, it won't. Wee. Yeah. Let's go on to 10 Carat Hill. Hello? Okay. Some sort of somewhat rare event over there, I think. Uh, let's try catching more Pokemon. Why not? As far as I know, you get a you get a nugget for at least three. 
but since you release them, might as well go for the uh, the highest score, huh? Hey, it's a big pack. Everything looks really nice, even at night. The models are perhaps a little bit brighter than they should be for something being done at night as the game sees it, but not bad. About the only thing that could have been better was if the stars moved very slightly in the sky. Or maybe, uh... Yeah, you know, the grass rustled a little, little bit in the background. But that might be a little bit much for the engine. Because I already know on uh, old 3DS, apparently, uh... Apparently there's frame drops in the totem battle. Whenever it summons its uh, partner. Which is not good. There you go, you got one. Keep up the good work. So there's that. Um, I didn't really notice any, but this is on a new 3DS, so it would be a lot more difficult to notice. There he lays. It's the closest thing to a catching move, really. I suppose, technically, I could just use, like, I don't know, a heal ball or something to try to catch one of these and then be on a more even playing field for catching. But with only the one uh, potion, I'd rather not. Alright, cool. So, it turns out that, like, data mining-wise, Game Freak was at least marginally better than they were last time. Not a lot better, but marginally so. There's still a lot of stuff that's, you know, dummied out, but... Uh, the fact that they just left all the, you know, they, they left enough information that you could just straight up see the images of all the Pokemon, uh, that says a lot. Gasp, I missed. How dare you. Um, want to try that one again? Nope. Nope, this one's just not to be. Or maybe it is. Come on, actually catch the thing. Must be a higher level than the last one. Or the RNG was messing with me. It might just be that the RNG was messing with me. That wouldn't surprise me at all. Now that I have three, it's like, hey, you're making me happy. And then, I think there's two more things the guy says. So I might as well see if that's showing those off. Also, since I didn't really do this do justice before, I want to see what happens when you get more than six Pokemon. Because I want to see whether it actually has any kind of DC system in it or what. I have to say, I'm feeling very optimistic for this generation. I mean, I... Okay, yeah, alright, fine. I feel optimistic for every generation. I think they've all been pretty good. They've all had their upsides and downsides, of course. They've all had downsides of some sort. But I think this one's going to be pretty good from the uh, the bits of data that we've gotten. This might be too low of a level to actually catch. Yeah, I kind of figured. So 
sadly. So we'll have to try a higher leveled one. Yeah. Either that or get a lower roll on our hit. This ought to work just perfectly. Just right. Thanks, Greninja, for proving me wrong. Really appreciate it. I, as far as the demo goes, I kind of wish that they had it more like the, uh, the, you know, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire demo. In which there was a bunch of different kind of missions. So that it wasn't like, oh, hey, come back on this particular date for a little cutscene. And that's about it. Uh, but there's still a fair bit of stuff to do. So I'm not too buzzed about it. Come on, catch. Oh, come on. You gotta be kidding me. Okay. That's pretty much nothing. It's a good thing that accuracy doesn't affect throwing Pokeballs. That would be a pain to have to deal with. And just catch it so we can go on. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Alright. I'm just gonna try with one more. Apparently, Pikachu can actually appear here. I have yet to see one in the wild, though. I was surprised when I saw a screenshot of somebody facing one. Alright, what level is this big effect? 30... Might just take it out with one shot. Yeah. Thir level 30 is just too low of a level for us to not one shot. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Be a higher leveled one if you don't mind. 32. That's pretty much what I was looking for. I, I take that back. Those words, I'm just going to take those right back and eat them. Delicious words. It's like eating swords, but without one of the S's. And also a lot less sharp. Well, actually, more sharp. Just less physically so. Alright, might take two area laces on this, considering it's rock type. Might take three area laces, but it'll be... Well, it'll be better to catch, certainly. More control on it. Yeah, I think I can go for one more of those. Presuming it doesn't crit. Yep. Excellent. Don't do much. Thank you. I have to say, the, uh, the shortcut for tossing a Pokeball is actually really nice to have. Hey! Alright. So, what's gonna happen now? Where do you want to send Rockruff to? Okay. Oh, nice! Okay, you can't see the bottom screen, but it gives you four options. Add to your party, send home to nature, which would probably be, you know, send to PC in other situations. Check Rockruff's summary, or check summary of your party Pokemon. Let's check Rockruff's summary here. Okay, decent stats. Um, vital Spirit, Odor Sleuth Howl, Rock Throw Bite. Huh. Let's check what our current party has. Because I can, really. Okay. Oh, there's a stakeout one. Good. 
right. All right, so I can just say, eh, just go go back to nature. Are you sure you want to send it back to home home to nature? Sure. You sent home Ro Rock Ruff home to nature. Amazing, you look like you've been throwing Pokeballs your whole life. I think if you catch, like, 18? Uh, yeah, well, no, no, no. Nope, that was the opposite of the one I wanted to choose. I think if you catch 18, he's like, well, you've beaten my record. Or something like that. Six Pokemon, wow, well, look at that. You've got the Pokemon catching challenge figured out. Here, I'll take back your Pokeballs. And then also release everything else. Sure. So yeah, that's... The demo is really nice. I'm trying to see if... There's apparently a somewhat rare thing on the beach, but I've yet to really trigger it yet, and I'm not sure if it's random or what. Yeah. The demo is really nice. And in case you were wondering, yeah, you can pirouette the other direction. It's the little things. Anyways, so, uh, next time... We'll probably do it on the next date that something actually happens in-game, since there's not a whole ton of things to do in between. It's certainly enough to get people playing the game more than once. Um, you know, to kind of keep it more or less in mind over, you know, the period of time. But yeah, four days. We'll see what happens with this girl and... Uh, the guy. So strong, so cool, the nicest you've ever seen. She'll show him off for us. I guess. So yeah. In four days, more demo stuff. And between then, probably more Pokemon Uranium. I'm working on some stuff to maybe speed up some of the, uh, some of the grinding. Er, not really grinding. No. D disregard that word. To speed up some of the, uh, battles and stuff. We'll see how that goes. Only one way to find out, though. And that's if you come back next time. So make sure you check back for that. And until then, farewell.